St. Baldrick may not be the name of an actual saint, but the namesake's event comes just a week after St. Patrick's Day, and it also includes shaving heads, so the name comes easily. But organizers say funding for children with cancer does not come so easily. To raise awareness and funding for the cause, the Omega Phi Alpha sorority played host to the third annual St. Baldrick's shaving event. After a WKU baseball game that went into extra innings and into the evening, the shaving began. I've never shaved my head before and I thought it would be uh, a good opportunity. Ben Kniff is having his head shaved for his grandfather Frank, who died of prostate cancer. I dedicated this to him. Um, I was very close to him. So I, you know, I just want to kind of do it in his honor today. 53 gentlemen, young and old, got their heads shaved, but this wasn't a men's only shaving club. The ladies had their locks clipped too. There's just a lot of people that never, a lot of kids that never have the opportunity to do a lot of little stuff. So any, this is little compared to, you know, what they need. So it's worth it. It's something that even the organizers couldn't do. Personally, I don't think I could do it, but um, I honor and I completely respect the girls who are getting up here. And as girls, we value our hair and they're just giving it away like it's like it's nothing. But these ladies took it in stride. It'll grow back. Mitchell Grog, News Channel 12.